It is probably the most anticipated news in the country. The resolution of the future of Konkola Copper Mines KCM is now a done deal. Mines Minister Poka Buswe is the bearer of good news. Following these consultations, I'm here to announce that we have finalized the negotiations with Vedanta. Vedanta will return to run and resuscitate operations of KCM as the majority shareholders alongside KC ZCCM IH. I want to say to Vedanta that underline the word resuscitate. Therein lies the benefit to the Zambian people. We don't want running battles. We, like the Minister Copperbelt said, the, the Vedanta under UPND is going to be different. We are very positive about that. And Vedanta Resources has committed $1 billion for KCM in the next five years to revamp operations. Dollar $1 billion investment over the period of five years to develop KCM. Dollar $250 million payments to the, all the local creditors. Dollar $20 million investment year on year into the community programs. And once off payment, Kwacha 2500, and a 20% increase to the, all the KCM employees with the intention to provide a long term stability. We have no doubt that the return of Vedanta anchored on the set mutually agreed terms and conditions of this renewed partnership will revamp this world class asset. The transition period for, Ved for Vedanta to assume KCM operations will take approximately three months to allow for the finalization of all required legal processes and the documentation. For civic leaders on the Copper Belt, the announcement is a relief for them amid this pressure that had mounted from residents who rely on the mine. I also want to thank the people of Copper Belt for being patient with this government. I want to thank the contractors, the employees, the subcontractors, and everyone who has been working and waiting for this day. So it's like you're giving life to a dead mine, and for Vindata to agree to have this issue sorted out of court, come back, agree on how to set out credits, is just a sign to say the confidence which the UPND government through our president, the able president, Hakane uh, has brought back to the country. And mine unions have urged Vedanta resources to fulfill its promises to the workers. The unions are there to safeguard the interest of the workers. The unions are there to protect the wages and the other conditions. And we are glad, Honorable Minister, that the 20% which is coming immediately, you take over. It will enhance the workers' ability to spend. Is that we are very, very happy uh, with what has happened. We thank the President of Zambia, Mr. Hakainde Chirema, uh, for resolving this issue. It has been a big, big issue for us. Since the agreement is already there, we would want some funds to continue flowing. And this I would urge the ZCMH board, working with the provisional liquidator and vendata. You have already agreed. So can we have funds begin to flow? Concora Copper Mines is one of the largest mining firms on the Copper Belt. The company runs Concora Copper Mine in Chirirabombwe, Nchanga Mine in Chingora, Nkana Smelta in Kitwe, and Nampundwe Mine in Shibunji District. Poshalala, ZNBC News in Lusaka.